Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Gonzo. Uh, so, we just got a new addition to the Gonzo's Photography uh, Tools. And I guess this is also a review. So this is the AOTS 250 Trail Cross. Uh, got it at West Central Power Sports in Canton, Illinois. Uh, honestly, I have not seen anything on online about this as much. Apparently, uh, this company used to be together with uh, Massimo Power Sports. Um, but here we are. It's a golf cart. Uh, definitely does not look like your regular golf cart. Uh, but this is a 250. Uh, it's roughly about eight i believe it's like nine horsepower um it's up to 25 miles per hour but honestly i i only need it use it in town and i probably only go like 50 miles per hour if I, I guess if i really want to go fast i just use one of my vehicles um i really like this thing um just got it registered to the town so here we are um it is street legal i love this thing uh, basically because straight out of the, straight out of the dealership, it is street legal. Um, let's see, uh, something I really enjoy about this is the fact that basically has all the bells and whistles I could think of. Um, even has a, a light bar on it. Uh, I haven't, I haven't used it, but it, it's pretty bright. Uh, turn signals, um, I took the, you know, a few dirt roads, and uh, <laughs> it was nice, so I got it a little dirty. Um, to be honest, this thing, I'm still breaking it in. Uh, as like an hour altogether. I've only driven it, yeah, for about an hour. Um, but I've been uh, following the breaking in uh, steps, so I'm doing a few intervals here and there. Uh, my son's school is around the corner, so I definitely take this, and he loves it and so does my family um especially here in town um i don't know who knows about uh dollar general or casey's and so it seems like every small town has one and so this is the perfect vehicle for that um especially in a nice small town uh but uh it does have some decent storage size so underneath here you know Get a nice little storage compartment. Um, this comes off, by the way, underneath the seats. Um, these belt buckles get in the way. I, you have to turn them. Uh, but here, let me just show you. And then you can see underneath there the engine. But uh, there's your little storage compartment. Of course, the glove box. It's got cup holders. Um small gauge there it has a horn of course uh a few things here i mean you could put some stuff in here obviously you got the soccer ball back there uh but yeah uh, the headrest is definitely perfect um i definitely lay my head back on there i have a little speaker up here held on by two tourniquets <laughs> hopefully i never had to use those for emergencies uh it's just got a it's got the backup mirror, uh, which here in town, we definitely, uh, well, the town requires it uh, to be street legal purpose. Uh, it is a little loud because it's gas powered, but at the same time, uh, that's got to probably have to do with, you know, uh, this back panel here, which actually I just got some uh, insulator, insulation, um, so that'll probably help out. Got the got the exhaust there, so of course the exhaust being so high up, it's definitely gonna cause like some humming, you know, louder sound. So I'm actually planning on uh, getting an extension to the exhaust and running it further down, and that should definitely help out with the sound. Uh, it does have seat belts, so so for you know front back, that's that's pretty nice. Um yeah i definitely say this thing is perfect street legal uh machine 
uh definitely enjoy it so far it's been pretty cold out here so i haven't been able to uh ride it as much as i really want to um but it's definitely pretty awesome so i guess uh over time i'll let you guys know after you know a month or two or you know even half a year to a year to let you all know how this thing is doing um so far the price was just perfect especially being brand new uh gas powered um but yeah I, and if you go online it's like i said i haven't found anything online about it uh, I was told, I called manufacturing at Massimo, and they told me that it's still the same engine. Some of the uh, drive suspension here is uh, is the same with the Massimo uh, 250. And so they just changed the look, um, added a few extra accessories. But I guess I'll just go off of those specs if it comes to it, but... Um, Hopefully, uh, uh, Odes ends up putting uh, additional, uh, their own support, own customer service. That way, uh, you know, at least I, it's not confusing to the rest of the world or the rest of the people that end up buying this machine. Um, this is brand new. It is a 2023. So, like I said, there's, I haven't found anything online uh, other than you know, people selling these things or dealerships. Um, Joy, uh, I guess until next time, have a good one.